Hey dudes, Bear goes right back for another tutorial, and today we are going to use the diamonds. The diamonds we found in last episode, yes, we are going to use them, and we are going to probably go do some mining. Um, I'm going to show you how to uh, mine stuff. Obsidian. Okay, just shut up. <laughs> Anyways, um, here we have a diamond pickaxe. I'll show you what it needs to be used for. Oh. I'm gonna bring an iron one just in case, um, I run into anything I want. I'm gonna put all this stuff in my chest here. And we're gonna go, um, mine. So, I will see you in a bit. Okay, so I've been digging and I found this amazing cave. And um, what I wanted to show you is with the bucket that I made uh, just a minute ago. I've already showed you how to make a bucket already, so pretty self-explanatory. Uh, we're gonna make... Oh, that's bad. Um, I'll make a new one. It's fine, I have plenty. Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry I'm doing so poorly right now. Uh, there has been a... A, b a bunch of things going on in my life right now. Uh, but... It's all good right now. So... Let's get that, uh... Lava... Up here. Okay, so it's basically self-explanatory. It's the same as your water bucket. You just grab it the same way. Uh, well, this is a pretty nice cave. I found it, um, walking around my house, I found it. So, it's actually pretty nice. I love it. We'll probably go exploring it uh, later. I'll probably do it off camera. Okay, so this is good. We have what we need. Um, you know, this is actually a perfect spot for what I want to show you. So today we're going to mine some obsidian, and the only way to mine obsidian is with the diamond pickaxe. Oh, which I have made. Um, I will get some enchanting done. That's why I'm doing this right now. Let's light up this area. That redstone's nice. Take some of this with us. <laughs> Honor the venture back. Um, okay, so anyways, <laughs> sorry I got a little sidetracked. Uh, we are gonna make obsidian using water and lava. Um, as you can see, we have water here, but for demonstration purposes, I'll show you a great way to get some obsidian. Let me uh, block this off. Because we do not want this water getting into the water we're going to use. Okay, we're going to use uh, this. This pot spot right here um, so we're gonna put water in first I think that's how it goes and we're gonna put lava wait oh that makes stone I did not know that um that was a fail I'm sorry guys um, this tutorial <laughs> It's not really good right now Let me get water Let's make some more water Should have just made an infinite pool I already showed you guys how to make that So I'm not going to do it again Um I think it was actually a lava down first Okay, so we're going to put a block a broche near it. And then we are gonna place this above it. And as you can see, that is obsidian. 
We're gonna have to do that multiple times. I just wanted to show you how to mine it. Um, and then, as you can see, this takes forever. Watch, it, it's gonna take a little bit. Okay, so we finally got it. So, it's very hard to get, but, um, you can simply put water over lava, and you will get, hint, hint, obsidian. So, uh, we're gonna be using this obsidian for many things, such as going to the nether dimension. I think I want to do that in this episode, but I want to do enchanting. However, I will have to get 30 levels, and I'll show you why. Uh, however, <laughs> sorry there's so many howevers, but um, this one's real important. The uh, enchanting system changes uh, in 1.8, so I'm going to have to update this whole area, and I'm going to show you some new stuff in 1.8. Uh, once it comes out, so I'll be right back. I'm gonna go mine some more obsidian get more lava and stuff You know the deal be right back. Hey guys. I just wanted to show you what lapis looks like because we're gonna need it for um, the 1.8 uh, Enchanting um, I did put it in 1.8. It's the pre-release of 1.8 so I did gather enough levels for um for enchanting in the maximum so that's good um, I don't know if I showed you already but I did get my obsidian I used lots of lava and stuff so yeah um, I'm gonna go back up to the surface and I shall make my enchanting table I'll show you how to make that. Also, the lapis can be mined, I think, with the stone pickaxe, if I'm correct. Uh, that's the least it could be. Um, so yeah. See ya. Okay, I'm back, and I'm gonna show you how to make an enchanting table, as well as a book, and paper, and stuff like that. So, here we go. Uh, sugar cane across in a row could be, like, down here or up here. But it just has to be three in a row, and you'll get three paper. Um, now we want to put the paper like this, and like that to make a book. You can do it anywhere, honestly. It could be anywhere, so you don't have to worry about putting it in the right order. Um, you put the book on top, two diamonds on the side, and four obsidian like so, and you get your enchantment table. So... Now that we got our enchanting table. Why are you orange and blue? This is not mustard and ketchup. Oh, that's right. Um, something happened to the, um, colors and in the 1.8 release. And red, or yellow is now orange and red is now blue. So if I... I think if I did this, no. Yeah, that did, that doesn't work. Anyways, let's get up here because I think I'm gonna um make a new floor for this. Oh, and we need more books. I'll show you why in a minute. I'll have to collect more sugar cane and stuff. I'll do that off camera. I just want to show you. So, you, you could place it and stuff, and then you'll have to mine it back with the diamond pickaxe. Uh, simple as that. Nothing real important. So, what we want to do is we want to put it like this. And we want to... Uh, sorry, this is all sloppy. That's my middle name. Just kidding, no it isn't. Um... So, what we want is... Okay, we have it. I don't know what I was doing. Uh, let's make more books. So, we're gonna need a lot more than this. I'll have to do that off camera, I'm sorry. 
I completely forgot about the bookcases. So we had to make some bookcases and it's simply books in the middle in two wood plank rows in the top and bottom. Then you get your little bookshelf. So now I got the achievement librarian. And I'll just make a little staircase up here. Just a little cute staircase. Um so that's a glitch. Uh, I think that's being fixed as we speak. Um, it still will have low enchantment levels only because I need more bookcases. So, you know what? I'm gonna go find more sugar cane. Uh, I did not think about this. Wow. This is gonna be lovely. See you. Okay, guys. I am back. Man, that took such a long time. And after all that, I I forgot about the leather, so I had to go click so much. <laughs> um, anyways, uh, so what you need to do with the enchantment table is you need it in the middle. And then you need, like, one space uh, between the bookshelf and the enchantment table like this. Uh, you, can, you need to do it all around as well. You don't really need the corners, I don't think. I think that was a thing. You don't really need the corners. Um, yeah, that's good. We collect this again. And it turns into books when you break it, which kind of sucks, but oh well. Uh, so we got 18 now. Okay, that's decent. But now we want to stack the books so that it does maximum of everything. I think I have more bookcases than I will ever need. 30. Okay, that's what we want. So... <laughs> God, collecting all that was a waste. I like... I have three left over. <laughs> Anyways, let's get enchanting. Okay, so basically you put in your tool of enchanting desire. In this case, I want to enchant my diamond pickaxe. There's efficiency IV, which I think stands for four. Pretty sure it does. I'm not that dumb. Uh, so you need, it says right here, you need three lapis lazuli. And you'll also need 30 experience points. And as you can see, I do have 30 experience points. So, um, too bad my mouse is disabled on this be much easier. So, I put in my three lapis, and now I can get efficiency four. But before I do that, I want to be smart. So, I'm going to see what my sword enchantment would be. Unbreaking. That's not bad. It's not good either, so. And this would be unbreaking as well. So, it's randomized. It's not like you'll get the same thing all the time. Uh, but, you know. Okay, so we're gonna click this. And it could come with multiple enchantments we do not know yet. So, unbreaking. Okay, unbreaking and efficiency 4. Efficiency is kind of like how fast it goes. So, like, it would break really fast with this pickaxe. Such as this clay right here. Look at how fast that would break. See? Barely any effort was made with that. Also, with the unbreaking, it means... Like, it's pretty self-explanatory, actually. So, I don't really need to expo uh, explain that to you guys. Um, I'm gonna break this wood here. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna need that for stairs. Uh, just for now. I know I'm gonna break this down later, but... So, let's see what we can get on this. So, I'm breaking three. Eh, not what we want, okay? I mean, we can get it if you want. So, if you want, if you feel lucky. If you feel lucky, you'll do it. But right now, I don't. So, um, yeah. So, that's basically all for this episode. I know it was pretty short, but... Enchanting and obsidian, it's pretty self-explanatory. Next episode, we will go into nether. 
Actually, you know what? Do I have enough time to go in the nether for now? I think I do. So, uh, it will be kind of a to-be-continued thing. So, I'll be right back. I'm going to show you guys how to go to nether. Yeah. 